Hello and welcome to the Game Dev Outpost. In this video, we'll be talking about lighting and light limitations in Godot 3. Godot uses what is known as forward rendering. And like many different rendering pipelines, there's limitations. Now this video isn't gonna be specifically about forward rendering, but if you wanna know more about Godot 3's rendering pipeline, I'll leave a link in the description. So we're gonna take a look at each one of the lights that are available in Godot 3, and we'll go through their limitations. So with the directional light, we can enable shadows. But what if we want to have multiple directional lights? What happens? What you'll notice is that a second directional light doesn't change the shadows. It does contribute some ambient or diffuse lighting, but it doesn't cast shadows. So if you're trying to simulate something like two suns on a planet, you can't really do that. Now the next one that we have is an omni light, and this can also cast shadows. But how many of these can we have? And what you'll find is that it seems like there's a limit to eight lights. After you get past eight lights, these lights won't cast shadows anymore. But that's not entirely true. The real situation is that you can't have more than eight Omni lights per object. Now let's take a look at the spotlight. So now that we've added a spotlight, even though we've reached our limit with the Omni lights, eight lights per object, we can still add in spotlights. And once again, what you'll find is that you have a limit of eight spotlights as well per object. So yes, this does look like a mess, but per object, you can have one directional light, you can have eight omni lights, and you can have eight spotlights. You're not limited on the amount of lights that you have, but you're limited on the amount of lights that you have on an object. All right, guys, that covers lighting and light limitations in Godot 3. If you guys thought this video was useful and it helped, please let me know by commenting down below and liking the video. Thanks guys.